Have you ever wondered who plays the most significant role in your health and well-being? Let's dive into the concept of personal responsibility in health. It's a topic that often sparks a lot of debate. Many people like to point fingers at genetics or environmental factors. And while these certainly play a role in our health, they don't paint the whole picture. Research continually indicates that individual choices significantly influence health outcomes. That's right, your daily decisions about what you eat, how often you move, and how you manage stress have a profound impact on your health. Consider nutrition. The food you consume is the fuel your body uses to function. Sure, your genetic makeup might predispose you to certain conditions, but a balanced diet can help manage them and even prevent them. Your favorite fast food joint might be conveniently located right on your route home, but making the decision to cook a nutritious meal instead can have a significant impact on your health in the long run. Next, let's talk about physical activity. It's no secret that regular exercise is beneficial for our health, but how many of us can honestly say we make it a priority? Our bodies are designed to move. Even a half hour walk a day can make a difference, reducing the risk of heart disease, stroke, and diabetes, among other conditions. And let's not forget stress management. We live in a fast-paced world where stress is often seen as a badge of honor, but chronic stress can wreak havoc on our bodies, contributing to a range of health problems from heart disease to depression. Learning to manage stress, whether through mindfulness techniques, hobbies, or simply taking time out for yourself, is an essential aspect of personal health responsibility. So while genetics and environmental factors certainly have a role to play, the power to influence our health lies largely in our own hands. The choices we make every day can either support our health or undermine it. Ultimately, you are the key player in your health journey. So what does science say about the impact of our daily habits on our health? Indeed, it's a question that has piqued the interest of researchers and fitness enthusiasts alike. And the findings? They're quite enlightening. Let's start with physical activity. It's no secret that regular exercise plays a pivotal role in maintaining our health. Studies have shown that it can boost cardiovascular health, reducing the risk of heart disease and stroke. Moreover, it can also enhance our mental well-being. Regular exercise triggers the release of endorphins, the body's natural mood lifters, helping to combat stress and anxiety. It's like a natural antidepressant that comes without a prescription. Next, let's talk about nutrition. A balanced diet is like the fuel for our bodies. Consuming a diverse range of nutrients helps maintain our body's functions, strengthen our immune system, and keep our energy levels high. And it's not just about what we eat, but also when and how much. Regular portion-controlled meals help keep our metabolism fired up and prevent overeating. So think of your body as a car, and food as its petrol. You wouldn't want to run your car on low-quality fuel, would you? And then, there's stress management. In today's fast-paced world, stress is almost inevitable. But how we deal with it can greatly affect our health. Chronic stress can lead to various health issues, including heart disease and depression. Engaging in relaxation techniques such as meditation, deep breathing and yoga can help manage stress levels promoting a sense of calm and well-being. The intersection of these three elements, physical activity, balanced nutrition, and stress management, is where the magic happens. They work together to create a synergistic effect, enhancing our overall health and increasing our longevity. So, as we can see, our daily habits are not just trivial routines. They are powerful tools in our hands, shaping our health and well-being. The science is clear. Your daily habits have a profound impact on your health. Knowing the science, how can you take charge of your fitness? Well, the good news is it's entirely possible and you don't need to be an Olympic athlete to do it. Let's start by talking about physical activity. We've all heard the phrase, movement is medicine, and it's true. Our bodies are designed to be active and physical activity is a key component of maintaining a healthy lifestyle. So how can you incorporate more activity into your everyday life? It's all about finding what works for you. Maybe you're a morning person who loves to start the day with a brisk walk or a yoga session. Or perhaps you're a night owl and you find that a late night workout helps you wind down before bed. The point is, there's no one size fits all approach to fitness. You have to find what suits you, your lifestyle and your interests. 
And this brings us to another important aspect of fitness, enjoyment. Yes, you heard that right. Enjoyment is a crucial part of any fitness regime. Why? Because if you don't enjoy the activities you're doing, you're less likely to stick with them. So whether it's dance, cycling, swimming, or even hula hooping, find a form of physical activity that you love, and you're more likely to make it a regular part of your life. Setting realistic goals is another important step in taking charge of your fitness. Start small and gradually increase the intensity and duration of your workouts as your fitness level improves. Remember, the goal isn't to become a marathon runner overnight. It's to make physical activity a regular part of your life. Lastly, don't underestimate the importance of professional guidance in fitness. A qualified fitness professional can provide you with a personalized exercise plan that takes into account your current fitness level, health conditions and personal goals. They can also provide you with the motivation and support you need to stick with your fitness regime. So there you have it. Fitness isn't just about hitting the gym or running a marathon. It's about finding activities you enjoy, setting realistic goals and seeking professional guidance when needed. Fitness isn't a destination but a way of life. And how about nutrition? How can you nourish your body for optimal health? Well, let's dive into that. Nutrition plays a pivotal role in how we feel, how we function, and ultimately, how we live. It's not just about eating. It's about nourishing your body with the right kinds of food. A balanced diet is one that is rich in fruits, vegetables, lean proteins, and whole grains. These foods provide your body with essential vitamins, minerals, and nutrients it needs to function at its best. Fruits and vegetables are packed with vitamins and minerals that help keep your body healthy and your immune system strong. They also contain fiber, which aids in digestion and keeps you feeling full longer. Lean proteins such as chicken, fish, and legumes provide the building blocks for muscle growth and repair. Whole grains, meanwhile, deliver sustained energy throughout the day and support a healthy digestive system. But let's not forget about hydration. Water is your body's best friend. It helps to regulate body temperature, lubricate joints, and transport nutrients to give you energy. So, make sure you're drinking plenty of it throughout the day. On the other hand, excessive sugar and processed foods can be detrimental to your health. They can lead to weight gain, increase your risk of heart disease and diabetes, and even affect your mood and energy levels. So it's important to limit your intake of these foods. However, remember that everyone's nutritional needs are unique. What works for one person may not work for another. That's where professional guidance comes in. A dietitian or nutritionist can help you create a personalized eating plan that meets your individual needs and lifestyle. So whether you're a fitness lover looking to fuel your workouts or someone just trying to lead a healthier lifestyle, remember this, food is fuel. It's what powers your body and mind. So make sure you're giving your body what it needs. When you nourish your body right, it rewards you with good health. But what about your mind? How does it fit into the picture? You see, when it comes to health and fitness, it's not just about the physical. It's also about the mental, the emotional. And one of the key aspects of that is stress management. We all face stress in our lives. It's a part of being human. But chronic stress, the kind that gnaws at you day in and day out, that's the real enemy. It can lead to a multitude of physical health problems from heart disease to digestive issues. So how do we combat this? Through mindfulness. Mindfulness is the practice of being present, of focusing on the here and now. It's about taking a moment to breathe, to appreciate the world around us, to quiet the chaos in our minds. By incorporating mindfulness practices into our daily routine, we can better manage our stress levels, leading to improved overall health. A healthy mind is indeed a part of a healthy body. So, where does this leave us in our health journey? Well, we've navigated the landscapes of personal responsibility, delved into the science of health and fitness, and explored the art of nourishing our bodies. We've also embraced the role of mindfulness in our wellness journey. But the bottom line is, it all circles back to one fundamental truth. The power to improve your health lies in your hands. You see, we're not just passengers on this journey. We're the drivers. Every decision we make, every step we take, shapes our health and our lives. The food we eat, the exercise we do, the habits we form, they all add up, painting the larger picture of our health. So, 
What's stopping us from taking that first step towards a healthier lifestyle today? Nothing but ourselves. Remember, it's not about the destination, it's about the journey. Your health, your responsibility. Take charge today.